G'day everyone, I've seen a few posts around the place uh, in certain industries that are encouraging people to buy gift vouchers now and, and spend them later. Uh, and if you're in, in one of those uh, industries where, where that's a bit of a trend, uh, there's a really simple way to add the ability to purchase gift cards to your website. So let's have a look at that now. Uh, my name's Jason Foss. I uh, stumbled across uh, an article on, on this website the other day on, on chrislima.com um, with a really simple way to add uh, gift vouchers or gift cards to your website. So uh, the example I'm using here is, is WordPress, uh, but the, the method we're using can be used in Shopify and other platforms as well. Um, but the examples and the screenshots we're going to look at here are specifically around, around WordPress. Um, so first of all, as we come down through here, uh, he's using a, a third-party platform called GiftUp to do it, which, you know, because they're doing all the heavy lifting, it makes it a lot simpler to actually do. And I notice over here, uh, when you go to sign up for a, a GiftUp account, they're actually offering a promo at the moment. So um, you use this promo code, COVID-19, um, and basically they're waiving their usual 3.49% uh, fee for the first $8,000 of gift card sales. Um, now, $8,000 is a pretty generous limit. Uh, I would think that, that you know most small businesses in, the, in this area um, are gonna struggle to sell $8,000 worth of gift cards um, in the short term, so uh, it's effectively removing that fee for the foreseeable future for a lot of people. So, um, so that's a really good offer at the moment. Um, so you can jump on that there. Um, but basically, they have a WordPress plugin. So you sign up for the account, you install their WordPress plugin, um, connect your API key, and I'll link to this article as well, so um, you can follow this in a bit more detail. Um, and it just basically then joins all the dots and does it for you. Now, in uh, in this example on Chris Lima here, he has uh, got WooCommerce installed already, and so it's detected that and already joined the dots uh, for him. Uh, but if you don't, if you've just got a standard WordPress uh, installed without uh, WooCommerce, then you'll be able to skip these steps. Um, and once you get down there, you can customize the look of your gift cards here, um, uh, customize the amounts. Um, there's a few different styles and templates you can choose from. Um, the default artwork there is, you know, is probably fine a lot of times, but you can customize that if you need to. Um, a few questions answered there, and basically it adds the you know the the checkout and everything to your website uh, in a few steps. Shouldn't take you too long at all. Um, the beauty is that the the e-commerce side of it, the payment gateway, all that sort of thing is is looked after by um, uh, by GiftUp themselves. So you don't have to worry about really doing anything um, on your website if you you know if you don't already have WooCommerce or e-commerce set up. This will just take care of the checkout process and everything for you. Um, so you, uh, you'll be up and running in a pretty short space of time. I'll link to the, uh, the original article here on chrislima.com either above or below this video depending on where you're watching it. Um, so follow through your steps there. It's, um, it's a pretty straightforward process and that way you can direct people um, to your website to, to purchase gift cards there. And especially with this offer now that GiftUp are doing, uh, waiving that, um, that fee, uh, it makes it even you know, more of a no-brainer thing to do. All right, that's it from me today. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you next time. Hey guys, appreciate you watching this video. Uh, YouTube seems to think that um, there's a couple of videos over here that you might also be interested in, and you can also subscribe over here if you're that way inclined. Thanks for your support. I'll talk to you later.